Now live from the federal courthouse, sharing an update on this case. Keith, good evening. Good evening, Dan and Jackie. B.J. Sanford and Mitch Moorhead arrived to court early this morning where a judge read aloud charges against them. The session lasting less than 40 minutes in total, but cementing the framework for this case going forward. The grand jury officially meeting yesterday to indict both of them on several counts. Count number one with conspiracy to obtain CSDs and counts two, three, and four on obtaining these CSDs fraudulently. Mitch Moorhead by himself has been indicted on three counts in this case, counts number five, six, and seven, which is distribution of the CSDs. The judge then asking Sanford's attorney, Sarah Skiglio, how did he plead? She responded, not guilty, Your Honor. He then asked Moorhead's attorney, Mary Merrick, how did he plead? She responded to not guilty to those charges as well. As the session concluded, Sanford stood up in the court. He turned back towards his family on the right side of the courtroom and said outside, I love y'all. Now, the next step in this case will be November 2nd, where both parties are going to meet inside the judge's headquarters. At that time, they will agree to plan future dates for this case. And also at that time, the judge will ask both the defense and the prosecution if they have any further evidence they wish to present that they have not yet in this case at that time. Reporting live from Shreveport, Keith Joganatis, NBC6 News. Dan and Jackie, back to you. All right. Thank you very much for that update, Keith.